The interview stage is time for you to shift from a mindset of a student to a healthcare professional. It's advised for you to go over GMC topics as well as NHS hot topics to enable you to answer as many questions as possible. The advice I'd give is do a lot of practice with your family and friends and mock interviews. Like I remember when I was doing my interviews, uh, I did a lot of practice for one of my friends who was also applying to medicine. And even video yourself answering questions. Make sure you're prepared, but also like don't be too nervous and just be yourself and stay composed. Uh, the advice I would give is to remember to be yourself. Um, the university wants to see what you are like as a person, so make sure you remember that. I think I would give them as an advice not to stress too much about it and to look at each question as a way to assess your skills that you should have as a future doctor. So think about what qualities you should possess as a doctor and try to present them answering the questions and everything should be alright. I would recommend knowing the UCLMS core values and curriculum. I would also recommend focusing on empathy, skills needed as a doctor and your passion for medicine and how that shaped your application. So it can be really overwhelming to figure out how to approach preparing for the MMI. All I used was free resources. I was a first generation university applicant. I had no connections to anybody in healthcare or that field. So using those free resources, I would just practice answering questions aloud in my room. And that really helped me. So it allowed me to uh, be successful in my MMI interviews. I actually recorded myself multiple times uh, and made sure uh, on reflection uh, that I'd answered the questions uh, that I'd asked, including facts and evidence from uh, NHS, from the NHS website, uh, from the UCL website, uh, and including key facts I wanted to remember and include in my answers. So I think the night before your MMIs is very important and it's very important that you get a good night's rest and you do something relaxing just to calm yourself down and make sure your nerves are low and you're in the right mindset to answer those questions for the day afterwards. I think one thing to remember about MMIs is that it's multiple mini stations. So if you mess up on one, don't worry, go to the next one, do the best you can. That interviewer hasn't seen what you did before, so start again and start fresh.